Steven's here today all the way from Newfoundland. He wants us to build him a way cool chopper. That's a long way from Vegas, so I'm thinking it's gonna be pretty cool. I'm getting with my man Shannon, and we're gonna put our heads together and see if we can't come up with a plan to design a bike that's worthy of Steve's trip from the Great White North. Steven uh, came all the way from Newfoundland. Wants to build a custom bike from the ground up. What are you looking for, brother? Uh, well, I want true flames. Okay, Real true fire. Flame. True fire. True, true, fire. true fire flame. Like, like some cinders, yep. ashes coming off, and, uh, and some skulls on the sides of the tank. Then on the rear fender, mm -hmm. uh, my dad passed away in November. I'm sorry. And me and him were best friends. I'm sorry for your loss. Me and him come to Las Vegas. Uh, I'm with you. Uh, we come every year for the world of concrete. Gotcha. And uh, we, I got a real nice picture of me and my dad on the Hoover Dam. And I want to get it airbrushed on the rear fender. OK. So every time I ride, I'm going to ride this bike. My dad will be with me. I wouldn't trust anybody else. Appreciate you trusting us with something it's, that special. This is just something that's, it'll be in my family for the rest of my life and the rest of my family's life. Amen. Yeah. You know, it's a real honor that Steve has trusted us with this project to remember his dad. Memorials, they are awfully tricky, so we're going to have to put all of our knowledge and know-how to get this one right. So let's, let's hit the office and get this thing rolling, baby. I got this. Heck yeah. This baby is gorgeous, and I cannot wait to see the look on Steven's face the first time he lays eyes on her. Come on, Steven. Good oh. to see you, bro. It's good to be here, Danny, man. I tell well, you, it's good to be here. Good to be here is just getting started. You're not going to smack this grin off my face for months. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I've had a few guys try. <laughs> no way, man. No way. Steven, my man, we are not going to eliminate that smile on your face. We're going to make it bigger. It's going to be bigger. I just want to recap here for a second. Why? You want a wicked bike. Because, brother, there's a wicked bike waiting for you right on the side. It's just, you know, with everything that's been happening with my dad and he pass, it's just something that I'll always have with him on it. Yes. And, you know, no matter what else you got going on in life, you sit on that bike and you go riding, and it's like nothing else can touch you. I feel the same way. You ready to check this baby out? Oh, man, I'm so ready. Shannon! Come on, bring that beautiful bike out, brother. Crazy. Steven wanted a bike to pay tribute to his dad, but he also wanted it to be big, loud, and mean as hell. Shannon started with a 125 cubic inch RevTech motor and built the rest of this monster with a Sugar Bear front end, a six-speed transmission, and dual shotgun exhaust. Then Ryan stepped in with an incredible true flame paint job complete with skulls everywhere. He finished it off with a tribute to Steven's dad on the back fender and even incorporated the Hoover Dam, just like Steven wanted. Spectacular, boys. <laughs> wow. Man, you just, you just nailed it, guys. <sighs> That's a... Yeah, brother. It's good, man. It's good. <laughs> That's good. Amen to that, man. Amen. Thanks, Dad. Thank you. Father, man. Thank you. Amen. Wow. Spectacular. Once I got to the rear fender and, uh, and I see the picture of my dad and I, uh, it just really kind of took me off my feet emotionally. You know, it was uh, just a real emotional moment for me. Wherever you go, brother, take him with you. OK, now I got to sit down. <laughs> Have a seat, and Shannon, give him the tour. You heard it coming out. This thing's badass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Six-speed transmission, two-inch belt drive. You got that gorgeous Sugar Bear front end. You got actual real functioning suspension front and rear. I know when we originally talked and we were supposed to put a kicker on this thing. Yep. I tried every which way I could. It wasn't flowing with the functionality of the bike. I'm like, man, I hope you can forgive me on that I one. I wouldn't change a thing. Steven, I got to know. We got your stamp of approval. I tell you, Danny, you got it, man. Amen. You guys can nail it. Amen, brother. Man, that's phenomenal. Steven threw us, you know, some yeah. crooked curves. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> I want a Pro Street, a Kicker, a Sugar Bear, and Hoover Dam. Right. <laughs> hey, you made it work. Thank you, brother. Thank you.
Man, I love building cars and bikes and special projects for people, but when we get to do something that memorializes a lost loved one that goes right to their heart, that makes it just extra special. I'm so glad that Steven loves his bike, and I'm so proud of the way my guys worked on it. I know that Steven's gonna enjoy this bike for many, many years to come. It's been a great day for this bike and a great day for the shop. Glad you're this happy, brother. Bad That's ass. the key. We're thrilled with it. So <laughs> that is bad. Ass. You being happy makes it all the oh, money. Oh, Dad, I couldn't be happier.